Hello friends, today I am going to tell you a story about a ghost of the abandoned mansion. Once upon a time, there was an old abandoned mansion on the outskirts of a small village. It was said that the mansion was haunted by a ghost who had been living there for many years. People claimed to have seen strange lights and heard any sounds coming from the mansion at night. One day a young couple decided to explore the mansion. They were fascinated by the stories of the ghost and wanted to see if they could find any evidence of its existence. As they entered the mansion, they felt a chill run down their spines. The air was thick and heavy and they could feel an ominous presence looming over them. As they made their way through the mansion, they heard strange noises and saw objects moving on their own. They were terrified but also curious to know more. Suddenly they heard a loud airy moan coming from upstairs. They cautiously climbed the stairs and when they reached the top, they saw a pale figure standing in front of them. The ghostly figure was that of a young woman who had died in the mansion many years ago. She appeared sad and lost as if she was still searching for something. The young couple tried to communicate with her but she simply vanished into thin air. As soon as the ghost disappeared, the young couple decided to run away from the mansion. After some time, the ghost again reappeared. The ghost told the couple not to be afraid and said that she wanted to share her sad story to all the villagers. But as no one else has entered this place, she could not share the same. She added that she will now tell her story to them. She told them that her name was Nancy and she was the only daughter of a businessman. One day her parents left her alone in the house and went to attend a business party. At that time the servants were also out for some work. While she was alone, she heard the ringing of the doorbell. After opening the door, she found two unknown persons. They pushed her back and entered the room. They collected all the costly items and were about to leave. Then Nancy tried to resist by using her kitchen knife. Upon seeing this, one person shouted and said, Darcy, take the knife. Darcy took the knife from Nancy and killed her brutally. From that day, Nancy wanted to tell somebody the true story of her life, but nobody came. She told the young couple that since they had come, she asked them to provide her with justice by punishing the killers. The couple, upon hearing the story, promised Nancy to give her justice. Then the couple came out of the mansion and searched for the killer. After some days, they found the killer from a nearby village. They informed the police, who then searched the prior complaint documents and arrested Darcy and his friends. After that, the couple visited the mansion again and stated the whole incident. Upon hearing this, Nancy became happy and blessed the couple and disappeared forever with a smile. After Nancy disappeared, the couple felt a sense of closure and satisfaction. They had fulfilled Nancy's wishes and brought justice to her by finding the killers. They also felt a sense of gratitude towards Nancy for sharing her story with them. As it had taught them the value of seeking justice and standing up for what is right. 
the couple continued to visit the mansion from time to time and although they never saw Nancy again they felt that her presence still lingered in the old mansion over time the mansion became a popular tourist attraction with people coming from far and wide to explore the haunted halls and hear the story of Nancy's tragic end as for Nancy her spirit was finally at peace knowing that her story had been told and justice had been served she could finally rest and her memory would live on forever in the halls of the old mansion mm-hmm.